can you uh, swap this around? It's committed to physical interaction. It's a sort of a sculpture. It's an, it's an installation to me, rather than only printmaking. It's to cut in the substance of the building and deal with the history of the building and try to get a relationship between you and the material, what you can find. And if it would not have been a wooden floor, if it would have been another floor, I would have done another floor piece, but related to the history and the social function, the so surroundings here, the red light district or the prostitution area, the cultural uh, impact, uh, so the housekeeper who used to live here before it was Villa Flores. It's dealing with material and reality and colliding as well at the same time. That's what makes fun. Because the new government, uh, they prepared the law that it can be privatized. So they are not doing it maybe now, but they, they want to prepare and make it uh, silently. And uh, probably other countries, other, other big uh, companies, Stat Oil, uh, British Petrol, Exxon, they would love to buy Petrobras, and uh, so uh, because of the coup, I put this here, and uh, yeah, maybe there will be a flame, and uh, in the flame are words like uh, another world is necessary not possible, like the slogan from the World Social Forum, that, that was the slogan, another world is possible, but another world is necessary. I don't know, we see. <laughs> Mas não sabe. 
O povo está com ideias exóticas que levarão o nosso país para a liberdade. Senhores pais, impeçam seus filhos de participar desses movimentos estudantes. I print with material I find, basically, most of the time. And uh, in this case, I found a wooden floor. And this was wonderful because I love to cut into wood. Uh, if I would have found another material, I would have dealt with the other material. So somehow the material found me. And uh, in this case, I got this wonderful building. and. Um, I, I was very happy that it has sort of already sort of a researched history. Uh, the architect was now Lutzenberger and, and all these little details. I come to the place and then the ideas develop in the process working with people from the side, from the city um, and to interact and then do the decisions what we depict as images. It could be as well an abstract work. I could as well build something if I get a permission. If this building would be, let's say, demolished uh, and the owner says, you can use whatever you want, maybe I would take down the wooden parts and build something like a tree or bring it back in the form before it was this beam or this floor and, and build a tree or make something else. It, it depends what is possible. Uh, yeah, it's open. That's the challenge. No primeiro dia a gente se reuniu aqui e ficou acho que o dia inteiro conversando só sobre política, uhum. só sobre os uh, problemas e peculiaridades do Brasil. A gente teve um brainstorm muito grande, assim, de tanto de uh, questões sociais e políticas quanto de imagens. Assim. A gente foi, primeiro foi conversando sobre tudo que está acontecendo, sobre tudo que aconteceu, sobre os principais marcos da, da nossa história. Uhum. E depois sobre como conectar isso com uma cultura imagética assim para fazer um trabalho, né? The students they have been really helpful and very interested, very open-minded and uh, in the first days for me it was so necessary to discuss the political situation, you know, the crisis and um, to get an understanding of the situation because my work is site related. So it has to do with, obviously, Porto Alegre, with Villa Flores, with the house, but as well with Brazil as a whole. So um, I, I was absolutely dependent on this discussion, otherwise I can't understand the situation on the ground. And if you don't understand the situation on the ground, you can't do a good site-related artwork.
Can we do that? No. Yeah? Now is the best. Let's first give it a print. Yes, the music. And of course, my understanding is still something like you get only some percentage of the whole uh, complex reality. It's always very complex and it's not just, yes, one thing and uh, Temer or uh, Dilma. And so it's, it, it's the whole social life is much more than that. And, um, that's the nice thing about uh, coming into other countries to learn from the people there and to get knowledge of their life and to get a relationship uh, built up. I think if you develop an artwork, as an artist you always need to have a challenge, something new, what you have to gain, what you did not know before, so there is uncertainty. And I didn't know, can we really use this floor, is it uh, brittle, is it hard, is it too soft, is it going to work and so on. So um, yeah, it's quite challenging and it was very good, interesting process again. The oil platform actually is looking not that bad. I mean, you need to know that it is oil. <laughs> <laughs>